Hi, my name is Martin. Uh, I'm working at Nokia in the social location team in Berlin and today we're introducing the OVSDK. So the OVSDK is really a tool to create applications built on this OV Maps player on the mobile. Anybody with basic knowledge of HTML, JavaScript can create OV apps. The SDK is a plugin in your web browser. It also contains a few example applications that you can run in the emulator and see how the different features of the SDK works. So the main features in the OV SDK is maps and location and navigation features, pedestrian navigation and car navigation. We also added UI components, lists, buttons, uh, toolbars that really makes it look really nice on the mobile phone. So for example, you can create uh, OV apps that are about events, local news, or uh, about public transportation or city guides. Deutsche Bahn is a very modern service company providing mobility and logistic solutions. We are the largest railway operator in Europe and we carry about 2 billion passengers per year. Our OV app is uh, truly innovative and simplifies travel planning. And the most important features uh, of our OV app is journey planning, including local and long distance travel. We have real-time data, so uh, the user can see if the train is delayed or not. We show the next stations, nearby stations, based on the user location, uh, and the timetables. And if someone wants to rent a bike, we also display our caller bikes on the map as well. And with one API, we are able to offer our content, our services, our products on a browser and a mobile phone at the same time very easily. So Quipe is Europe's largest local review network. We're available in seven languages, on ten sites, and now, of course, on OV Maps. For the team here at Quipe, it was really easy to dive into uh, OV Maps development. And in fact, it only took us um, two weeks with two people to get our finished version of Quite Radar. We were particularly excited about the, uh, the 3D flying view and, and features like that that aren't available necessarily on other maps platforms, which has really sort of enhanced Quite Radar and giving it something different on the Nokia platform. We're really excited here at Quite finally to mash up the power of the um, Open Quite API with the Nokia Maps SDK and uh, bring Quite Radar to all the Nokia users in Europe. Hello, my name's Ushma and I work for Lonely Planet. I've been working very closely with Nokia looking at exciting ways to access the Lonely Planet content through Nokia Maps on devices. Working with OV apps allows Lonely Planet content to be accessible by millions of people all across the world. We've got a lot of experience at Lonely Planet working on, on building web-based applications. So working with the OV SDK and creating something similar for mobile was a really smooth process. The application recognizes where you are and it will show you what's available around you, whether that's restaurants, hotels or, or sites that you can see in that destination or it allows you to actually free search so that you can type in a, a main attraction or a restaurant that you want to go to based on a Lonely Planet recommendation and help navigate your way there. This really complements our vision of having Lonely Planet content available to our travelers in their everyday lives, anytime, anywhere. HRS is a distribution partner with over 250,000 partners worldwide. We're one of the world's leading hotel reservation service providers, offering over 250,000 properties around the globe. We're very confident that the mobile conversions will continue, and this is why we're very excited for the future and especially opportunities the OVA platform offers for our potential customers. Corporate travelers are the cornerstone of HRS strategy for the future, so if they're on a business travel, and they're looking for a hotel room, they are now in the possibility to use a mobile device, select the hotels by the appropriate star rating, the price level they are willing to pay, or even segment the hotels based on preferences from other customers to make the right choice at the right price, at the right time, in the right location. Typically, internet services are built for big screen PC devices, but on mobile, you need a way to make it more relevant. And Maps is great for that. It's a great way to visualize the data. So OV Apps is really about what's around me uh, right now, uh, right here. 